Hey, my beautiful lovelies. How are you guys doing? Oh my goodness. So, today is technically supposed to be day 19 of Vlogmas. I have been kind of in a different mood the last several days, so I really haven't uploaded or filmed at all, and I'm just going to like be honest with that. So, Vlogmas is probably going to go ahead and be over. Um, I'm not sure. I think I'm just going to start trying to like just upload when I can. Um, it's just really difficult for me to try and do Vlogmas and film and edit and stuff every single day when I have work and stuff and I just have so much stuff going on. I didn't realize just how much of a chore it is to do. Well, not really a chore, but like just how difficult it can be. So, I mean, I'm probably going to like continue to film. So, I'll just say that this is Vlogmas Day 13. But, um, I'll continue to upload and stuff like still film for Vlogmas. But it's just going to continue on into January more than likely before you get to the end of Vlogmas. But that's just how I have to do it because it's just <clears throat> too much. It's a lot. And my voice, I'm sorry. So bad right now but there's really nothing I can do about it it's been acting up a lot lately but I had my first therapy appointment yesterday and I mean it went pretty well I was extremely um, anxious for it and stuff just because I haven't done therapy in few years. It's probably since like 2013, 2014. It's 2013, I'm pretty sure, because that's when I came out. Yeah, so it was 2013 when I went into therapy and stuff, and that's when it ended. Um, <clears throat> it's just been a struggle to kind of keep my mental health going. I didn't really have a choice. I kind of had to go. Um, <clears throat> it's not that I was forced to go. It's that I made the decision that it was like, I have to do it. I have to. So, my therapy appointments are once a month. So, I mean, I could have done it once a week. But I just felt like that was a lot. Especially since I have work and stuff and I didn't want to constantly have to take off. So I just decided to do it once a month so I don't have to worry about all of that and worry about missing a lot of work. Um, I am about to
because I tend to turn my phone on silent just while I'm lighting clients' houses, so that way they're not hearing every single time that it goes off. And with this watch, I got the rose gold one, but with it, um, I can actually like know whenever I get a message or something because it vibrates my whole arm. And a little surprise for him is, which it's not really a surprise because he kind of already knew it, but he didn't really know how long it would take. I have been saving up my tips and I've been telling, like I have been telling him that I was going to save up my Christmas tips and all that that I got from clients to use towards my iPad. But the joke's on him because I'm actually using my tips. I have enough to pay for it in cash um, to get him the Galaxy Watch as well. So, because of course, like right after he gets mine, which we got it at Target, and it was $179 something like before tax and stuff. Um, like that was on sale at Target. Well, I looked on it. I looked it up today on Google and like it came up with a Samsung like actual website. Well, they're having a sale. So it's $149 and something. And then I looked on Amazon and it's the same. So I'm gonna go ahead and order it off of Amazon. Um, I think he's gonna order it because he has Amazon Prime. I don't, but he does. So I think he's going to order it and then I'm just going to pay him the cash because I I have the cash. Because after tax and stuff, um, when you order it online, it is $162. So I'm definitely, definitely have enough. <laughs> I mean, I have like just enough. It leaves me with about like $37, $47 left probably. Because I also have like cash on gift cards and stuff. So with all of that combined. So I'm excited. Like both of us got what we wanted this year. And I needed a new straightener because I broke mine. He got that for me. I wanted new boots. He got those for me. He needed some new jeans. He needed some shirts. So I got those for him. And then I also got him. because he really wanted those and stuff so we both got what we wanted and stuff I mean to be honest I mean yes like I wanted an iPad for Christmas like that was the only thing that I wanted and that was the only thing that I asked for for anyone <clears throat> like from anyone but just to like all go in on it because I wanted it for work so that way I can actually see what I am doing when I'm editing and all of that. But, you know, like at first I was a little upset because um, some people backed out and stuff. But, I mean, I'm kind of at the point now where it's like, I, I kind of understand. Like, because the one that I wanted is like over, a little over 500 after tax and stuff. And like probably after the there's like no telling how much the warranty is going to be on it and stuff so I mean I think it's actually kind of a good thing that nobody went in for it so I can just use my tax money when that comes in like after I pay off some bills and stuff um, to get me one <laughs> for work just like I said so that way I can edit my videos and stuff and I can actually see what I am doing because when I try to do it on my phone I cannot like hardly see what I'm doing so it makes it very difficult and it takes a lot longer and then I cannot like I can't answer text messages or anything like that because when it's exporting um into my gallery I have to leave my phone on that app and everything a little frustrating but I am home now <clears throat> my voice has just been it has been giving me so much trouble lately and it's driving me nuts 
and I'm really mad because I've been trying to grow my nails back out since I got acrylics and okay look like what it is doing to my finger well, if it'll I don't think it will focus well it won't focus but like it left indentions on my nails and then like my nails have been so fragile so they just keep snapping off the only ones that haven't yet so far are my thumbs and my pinkies but other than that like I broke like these two off last night trying to turn my steering wheel <laughs> so you know it's it's a struggle but anyways I'm gonna go in here and um, eat because I'm really hungry and let my babies out to go potty and then I am going to um, head on over to my parents. I have some exciting news to tell you guys about a Christmas gift um, for a certain someone. I'm not going to say who and I'm not going to say what but um, when that day comes I will definitely film it and stuff and I will put it on one of my vlogs just as long as this person is okay with being on camera because that's my thing like I don't want to force somebody to be on camera it's like if you don't want to be then you don't want to be so okay my neighbor's gone so I can get out and not look like a weirdo filming myself I got Oreos last night and a whole bunch of snacks I get really awkward with it just because I don't know how to like really react but it is so cool to like actually have people be watching my stuff and everything and be enjoying it I mean like I know that my vlogs can get pretty boring probably just because like I don't really have a very interesting life. I don't really, I don't travel and stuff like that because <laughs> I'm broke, I'm poor. So, you know, you just kind of do what you have to do. But, um, I just made it home. As you know, because I told you just a little bit ago, I'm so stupid. Oh my goodness. But, I'm gonna eat and then take my babies out to potty. Then I'm gonna head over to my parents so that I can wait on um, the package and I can visit with my parents because I haven't seen my parents in a little bit, probably since Thanksgiving. I'm pretty sure that was the last time I saw my parents. I mean, I'm. I'm gonna see them Saturday and Sunday, but you know, 
that's just for holiday stuff. I just actually like want to go and spend some time with just them and see them. So sorry, now I'm going back and forth, but I'm trying to clean up my living room a little bit. Just a little bit. I washed my hair yesterday and these bangs, like, I don't know what they're doing, but they need to stop. <laughs> they're like feeling so stringy and just weird and I don't like it at all. I guess I can set you. Yeah, I can set you right there. But I am just having a leftover Chinese food that I ate last night. So I didn't eat it all. I usually don't. Sometimes I do. It just depends on how hungry I am. But Ransom and I started watching um, Shameless last night. I've never seen it before and stuff. So it's kind of. Um, one of those things that like my sister told me about and I was like okay like I'll try it um, we're only on episode one still because it's by the time that we started watching it last night I like, got home and started watching it it was late so then we had to go to bed but um, it's it's different it's very interesting. Um, <laughs> it's definitely not a show for kids or for younger kids. It's definitely a show for like adults or like older teenagers and stuff. Um, it's got like a lot of nudity in it and a lot of like sex scenes and stuff. And I mean, that's fine. Like. It's just TV. It's just a show and everything. But it's like, oh my goodness. <laughs> that is like one thing that I kind of took from the Game of Thrones. Um, I think I only got to like maybe the middle of season two. And I was like, I just cannot do this anymore. Because for one, there's just too much dying in it. And too much of that kind of stuff in a show really tends to like make me depressed and it worsens my depression so I try to stay away from really sad stuff or like things that have like a lot of death in it and all that um just because of that but also like just there was so much sex in it that it was like confusing at first because I mean, like, it really confused me when the queen got caught with her twin brother. And at first I didn't realize that they were, like, brother and sister. And it really confused me. And then when I figured it out, I thought it was, like, really gross and weird. So, I try to stay away from that kind of stuff. Because that's just, huh? <laughs> like, it just kind of grosses me out a little bit. Just a little bit. Oh my lord, these eyebrows need to be done. Really badly. I think, like, what would be really good is if I just, like, you know, took my razor and just shaved them completely off and then just drew them on. But I don't know if I could draw them on very well. It makes them look realistic. So, we're not going to do that. No, we're not. As you can see, we have all of our Christmas gifts. Um... I'm pretty, I think we're done shopping. If I'm being honest, I'm really not positive, but I think we are done shopping. Um, I hope so, because I hate shopping. And Christmas just really tends to stress me out, especially when you have to constantly get gifts for people. Ooh. Don't want to show you my hoodie. Don't want to show where I work at. <laughs> All right. Now, we're just having leftover Panda Express. I 
love Panda Express. It is so good. It is my absolute favorite. To be honest, it's like the only Chinese food that I will actually eat. So, And I don't need it with chopsticks because I don't know how to use those. <laughs> I really don't. I don't understand how to use them at all. Son of a seed biscuit, that's hot. I think I like got it a little too hot. But it's alright. Let's see. We're just gonna go enjoy this really quickly like while I watch TikTok and YouTube. At first, like, when I heard about TikTok, I was like, oh my gosh, like, that just sounds really stupid, really boring, and, like, I had been seeing some videos and stuff that were from TikTok, and I was like, oh my god, no, like, that's cringy, but then I kind of got sucked into it, so now I've been, like, binge-watching TikToks and stuff lately. It's kind of really bad. <laughs> I don't watch it for like the dancing and stuff. I watch it for like the comedy section because comedy is like my favorite thing. Ew. Why do I look so ugly? I look so ugly. But anyways, um, I'm just gonna end this vlog here. I may film for tomorrow, tonight like while I'm headed to my parents and stuff like that so just know that like all the days are going to be uh like messed up yes today's the 19th but it's going to be vlogmas day 13 just that's just how I have to do it because like I can't catch up so you know it's just going to go on into January more than likely but I love you guys and thank you so much for watching and, um, oh, <laughs> don't forget to subscribe, hit that like button and that notification bell. So that way you get every single notification for every upload that I do and comment down below or where to find the comments is really hard for me because I don't know where the comment section is on videos, like, because they moved it. But anyways, don't forget to comment anything that you have, like ideas or anything like that, just to say hi. Add me on Snapchat, Evan36325587, or you can also follow me on Instagram at EvanRay underscore.